Nathan Kolba. I'm the co-founder of Freedom Shark, and we provide private label training, product branding, photography, copyright listings, all things Amazon, all things private label. The best way to build brands uh, on Amazon with private labeling is to develop and see what's out there already and how can you make your product stand out. Um, how can you develop that following to where you know, when people are looking for products on Amazon, you'll see a lot of the same type of products. So what's going to make you stand out you know, uh, against 10 different listings on there? It's going to be your brand. You know, Amazon has started really putting their emphasis on brands in, within their platform in the last couple of years. They are requiring a trademark to get brand registered, but those people are allowed to do what's called enhanced brand content, which gives you a whole new section on your listing where you can add video, you can add more images, more graphics, more details, and they're actually giving brands the ability to have their own web store on Amazon. So the emphasis that Amazon is pushing towards brands makes it that much more important to make sure that yours is established and well known so that when people hit your page, they're able to convert and you're able to make more sales. So the importance of branding and creating an actual story that's going to help sell your products is critical. People are looking for a company to relate to. They're looking for a story that they can grab onto to be a part of, um, to feel like they're part of your company and that they're actually helping you with your brand. So when we talk about creating a story, we are wanting it to be authentic. We want to create that trust with them. So we don't want to make anything up, but we want to make it creative. We want to state the problem that they're looking for to solve. We want to actually give them a solution and we want to show them what, why our product makes it successful. When it comes to marketing your products on Amazon, off Amazon, I like to tell people to start on Amazon. Put your marketing dollars there first because that's where the buyers are. When you go to Amazon, you're ready to shop. Okay, you're, you're, not, you're not searching, you're not researching, you're searching for something specific and you're ready to buy. So I suggest putting your marketing dollars on Amazon first. Now as far as band, brand building, um, you can start to use your Facebook channels, Instagram, to start to get that audience and build your brand outside of Amazon and that's going to provide more traffic coming to Amazon when they're ready to buy. When we talk about the importance of quality in your products and your services and your customer service, that all is critical this day and age. You know, the customer service has gone down the tubes. And so if you can provide that along with a great quality product, it's going to really accelerate your sales and people are going to respond to that. You know, it's, there's nothing worse than getting spending 20 bucks for a product and having it break down in two weeks. So the importance of quality in your product is critical for your success. And it's better to spend those extra dollars up front to make sure that you don't have um, a lot of returns, a lot of mistakes with your products, poor quality, because people are going to catch on to that and it's going to get out there that don't buy from this company because they have poor quality products. I mean, quality is truly the foundation of a successful business. If you ground your business on quality of products, quality of customer service, it's going to show with your customers. Customers are going to respond to that. They're going to be more willing to share your brand and your products with other friends.